President Mohamed Buhari on Wednesday spoke on the need to quickly reduce the number of new coronavirus cases. He warned against the early signs of community transmission getting worse and challenged the presidential task force in COVID-19 to break the link to community transmission. President Buhari spoke on Wednesday during the teleconference with members of the Boss Mustafa-led PTF in Abuja, Mustafa, who revealed some details of the virtual meeting with the president, the State House reporters, explained that how fast Nigeria moves to contain the spread would make the difference. Mr. President was able to hear from them firsthand, not a report through the leadership, uh, as embodied in my person. He did ask some questions, he did make some uh, con contributions on basic issues, and gave certain directives that we are working on ensuring that those directives are complied with. And he took our time to, to thank them personally for their commitment, for their patriotism, and for their dedication to this cause. And the reassurances that we got from Mr. President, I believe, would go a long way in helping the members of the committee become more determined and more resolute in the pursuit of this thing. Do you know some of the new presidential directives to the task force? More aggressive tracing, tracking, and uh, isolation uh, of those affected or those that have shown symptoms, testing to break the chain of any community transmission. Uh, I can assure you that there won't be transmission. There will definitely be transmission, but, but if we are able to get ahead of the transmission, then we can deal with it decisively. But the measures that have been taken are not punitive in any way. These are measures that are meant to secure the lives and the wealth of our people. Like Mr. President said, it is not a joke. It is a very, very serious issue. But there's no time to play games. We're dealing with an unseen enemy that is vicious, that spreads fast, and that is not a respect of any protocol. So our people will need to understand that everything that Mr. President has put in place is for the good of our people and of our nation. And collectively, I believe, if we cooperate with the government and the processes and the protocols that have been put in place, I can assure you that we will be able to break the transmission and flatten the curve.